Hey guys, today I've got the most special vessel on the charter market as of yet. There is nothing like this. It is literally the pinnacle of charter vessels. It's guys, a 2022 X95. Now look at this, look at this gorgeous creature. I was actually shocked and amazed when I found out this is actually entering a charter market. An owner would actually put this in the charter market. Well, he did, and it is literally, uh, I don't want, don't want to diminish the, the quality of the other vessels I've done, but this is by far heads above. Uh, it is, was always my personal favorite, and, uh, and uh, when it came to fruition and he joined the charter market, I was, I was uh, you know, uh, speechless. So anyway, um, it is a 2022, like I said, the Princess X95, it's called Monopoly, and it's literally monopolizing the entire charter market. Okay, so uh, the busy cleaning, this takes several hours to clean. So we will be, again, obviously it's not, um, obviously so there's some water spots. So anyway, let's get this going. Uh, either way, I mean, this beauty is uncanny. Okay, so this is her and uh, follow me guys, let's get on this. do it okay so just our luck they're doing work on the Millennium behind us and we have a bit of a, a noise description discrepancy but anyway that being said here we are guys we're starting off the first in little spot which is the the cockpit of this amazing amazing creature of course everything about her the teak the the lining everything is literally brand spanking you in a sense okay large uh, table back here seating clearly can put 13 here very very easily and a very long overhang look at this beautiful shape how this is designed the superstructure on her is incredible there's obviously the bar there's obviously a sink back here Dimitri you know highest quality material this I think is granite and back here of course we have kind of a look Dimitri the off we have a, an ice maker here of course we have a top loading fridge and an ice maker of course perfect little setting here the first initial spot okay let's make our way back to the swim platform the spacing here of course is uh, everything is wide we have a very large uh, uh, tender here as well here's the monopoly sign let me have a look at it and of course back here we have uh, the crew quarters as well as a crew mess so uh, I'm not going to show you this for now, but anyway, I'll, I'll cut in a, a picture so you can see how it is. It's a crew mess here, so when if you want to party out here, you can have a nice little area here. There's also a little galley, so you can actually relax, get some shade, apart from actually going over to the cockpit. So, um, yeah, this is a monster as well. And uh, this is also hydraulic. So this little section over here sinks down into the ocean, and the, the parts on the side are stationary. Okay, it is obviously a Eurotransom, so there's, there's walkways on both sides. and. Oh yes, also, yeah, Dimitri, thank you for reminding me. So this is very unique about the, about the, the off-swim platform, is the fact that it, yeah, it, 20 feet exactly. So this actually, if you want to say it's a 95 footer, but you can actually consider it a 115 footer because this thing extends outwards and folds inwards. So this, ima it, imagine this, I'm also gonna cut in a clip, but imagine this folding outwards and they can also, it's also used for stir to birth boarding. So you can actually com configure the height in order for disembarking and embarking so very easily uh, very very unique I'm gonna cut that old feature in uh, along the way so let's keep this going so we have the flybridge over there and then over here that takes us to the bow so let's get the flybridge directly and check out the interior afterwards so large and expansive the unique thing about this, the main deck and the flybridge has, have almost the same square footage. So from stern, to, uh, from, uh, from stern to bow, you get the same square footage in the sense of space. You can see this, this is expansive. It's huge, sun pad in the center, beautiful jet ski covered. See this is the davit for the jet ski. And then we have a very, very large alfresco down in the center. And then of course on the sides, uh, I believe these are, is this storage? No, these are also top loading fridges and obviously grill tops. So, of course, this has everything, everything you can imagine. So, that being said, um, I'm going to leave the 
the best for last. Actually, let me show you. Let me show you this. It's, of course, everything is beautiful about her. We can't basically uh, <laughs> skip something and say something is not worthy. So, what gives it that crazy feature is this beautiful bow hot tub. So, this bow hot tub is is unlike any I've ever seen. This is obviously super yacht quality. It is actually a super yacht in reality. And I'll also cut in the picture or some videos of it in action. So imagine sitting here while cruising, having everything waterline, almost very similar to the uh, hot tub I did of the New Marine 80 a week ago. But anyway, padding every very, very large U-shaped seating area over here. And over here, this is the inside here, we have the main uh, VIP cabin, which we'll see in a second. Uh, something also very nifty is right here in the front there's a nice little romantic personal spot you come uh, enjoy yourselves here so there's various sections uh, you can go socialize and get away if you want to and my apologies this is <laughs> the uh, the VIP cabin and that is the helm station uh, like I said everything is is incredible very safe obviously everything's very high the bulwarks and uh the safety rails as well okay great so solid construction everywhere let's go this way i'm trying to avoid that sound it just so happens there's a uh, construction so as you can see we went all the way and down here we'll be entering back to the main deck of course, there is side access here as well, but we'll be entering the interior through the main access, which is aft. And look what we've got here, floor to ceiling glass, okay? So this brings in tons and tons of natural light. And also these bulwarks, as you can see, they're opened. So it just flows right through. What an incredible, incredible boat. We have another side access panel here. And then we can make our way inside. So here we are, guys. First class all the way. Uh, these are, you can see now the floor to ceiling windows from the inside. How beautiful is that? This is a penthouse on the water. Very large seating over here, pop up TV, starboard, formal dining area, beautiful bar area here as well. Has everything. So, of course, the sink. Back here, of course, we have an ice maker and a fridge. Perfect little bar for entertaining. Of course, moving forward, this is actually an internal stairway to the flybridge if you want to. And then we have this gorgeous commercial style galley. These are the, the fridges, nice and discreet, enormous, and basically everything you need, right? As a side access panel, and then of course we have here stove tops and uh, all the appropriate things for a perfect kitchen of course this can also be closed off if you want privacy if you have catering or a chef and you don't want to disturb your guests uh, down here of course is the accommodation and here in the front is that main vip cabin um, now here we are how beautiful is this lovely carpeting this is luxurious to the touch and over here is like i told you that, that glass that looks out into that private little nook um even though there's another four cabins on this boat this for me is as a vip some call it the master cabin but uh you can pick and choose because everything for me is wonderful so here we have the let me come have a look dimitri obviously this is the bathroom area his and hers bathroom uh sinks we have a rainfall shower over here, and then of course here is a separate uh, bathroom, separate toilet. Beautiful little table here as well. Glorious, truly, truly glorious. Okay, let's make our way to the accommodation. It's right here, centrally located. Oh, God, it's so nice being on a new boat, huh? It's really lovely. So we have four cabins. Right there behind you, Dimitri, is uh, the VIP. Of 
course, is changing out the linens. Uh, I, came, I came right here in between all the work that's being done, but um, you know, I made some time because I'm currently I'm leaving for Europe tomorrow, so I want to squeeze this in. Look at that, how modern and contemporary everything is. And of course, these windows, once they're lifted, you know, gives everything that glorious look. I think it's a walk-in closet. Yes, it's a nice walk-in closet for those long-term charters. And then uh, we have two guest cabins on either side. Two, of course, adult size. And then, of course, there is a bathroom, an ensuite for each of the cabins. There's another one right here, which is basically identical. I won't show you that because it's currently locked, so I can't show you that. And then all the way midship over here, basically, we're not all the way in the aft. This is the VIP, or I would say it's a master, even though, you know, once again, uh, large seating area here as well. That's a walk-in closet next to you, Dimitri. And then over here is another identical to the main cabin up above, his and hers toilet separate and a rainfall shower identical in every way beautiful marble flooring and the carpeting is so so luxurious i guess that's it so we have a total of four cabins down here one above in the main deck so we have five cabins all in all uh which sleeps 10 very very comfortably and the crew quarters which are which i'll i'll try cutting the picture which was actually by the off swim platform that has a captain's quarters and two uh, bunks for stews and of course there's a mess a mess hall there and a galley okay so let's make our way up okay it's coming to a close and we're going to actually make our way over here uh, this is to the flybridge but the sky the sky lounge the interior part of that flybridge here we are nice little area over here this is the flybridge that we previously saw. As you can see, once this is nicely opened, you get that beautiful, you can, you can push that all the way up, all the way. Let me just show you with that. And they can slid, that can be slid, that can be slid all the way down and have a nice flush opening from uh, Sky Lounge to the Flybridge. That noise is driving me nuts, so I've got to keep everything closed. Nice large 65 inch TV over here. And of course, this is the, this is the heart of the vessel. Everything, latest technology, two humps, um, seats, and a nice little companion seating over there, U-shaped seating. Um, yeah, so I guess that's it. Let's say our goodbyes. You know what? Let's go say our goodbyes in the front there, which I love so much. Do a, a nice lo last little trip. I keep unlocking this. Follow me, Dimitri. And we can also get to see Marvel at the glass paneling here as well. Everything's surrounded by glass. So I guess. This is perfect right here with the backdrop of the hot tub. So I guess that's it guys. Very quick. Um, sorry for the noise, but we have the 2022 Princess X95 called Monopoly. And uh, like I said, nothing like her. The only, the only one on the market and it is taking everybody by storm. So anyway, thanks for stopping in. Uh, if you're interested in renting this beautiful creature, reach out to me. And as always, try to safe and I'll catch you the next one. See ya.